dogs on but uh, yeah yeah recently I've had quite a few contacts we do get quite a bit of contact of people uh, seeking advice and this that and the other and uh, again brought back to my attention is the amount of people buying some of these dogs over here in Thailand and going for sort of show dogs, better class champions and stuff like that. And what I'm beginning to find is I'm getting a lot of information about how after they've bought them and maybe after a year, these dogs have died. So let's go on to this further. There's quite a bit of uh, interbreeding going on. Whereas if they get the good strain that they're after, they'll do it. Whether it involves grandfather with granddaughter or uh, daughter or whatever. And it's a route to disaster. And basically, it's not doing what we are trying to do, is to keep this breed true along the line. 
Not line braiding neither. No, no. Right, that's my advice over. Now, yeah, so uh, finally, uh, as you can see, you know, I've probably previously mentioned, uh, pubs are coming on nicely. Uh, Mem's busy uh, at the moment uh, trying to do a bit of land, a bit of fencing, as you can see coming on here. And uh, and then back to say the pups, I'm sort of watching the pups a bit. So that's about it for this vlog. And as I said, you've got a bit of farming stuff coming on. And uh, we'll see you on the next vlog. So it's keep watching. And Some nice looking mangoes developing on this tree. But by God, I'm gonna need some ladders to get up there. Now, as you can see on this mango tree, there's some nice sized ones coming on. And I found out what the uh, the red bottle and the other bottles for. It's to attract the red ants. So it's a feed for them because they do the tree good because of any pests, other insects that cause problems to the growth and development of the tree, the ants get them. So yeah. It's a feed for the Red Army. Hmm, there you go. You learn something every day. Well, here we are cutting uh, down these uh, fallen bamboo uh, branches. So obviously Mem's doing all the bloody graft. So, and this uh, is going to be used over the bridge on the other side to uh, fix the uh, fence at the bottom to stop the dogs trying to get out. So it serves a purpose. And when you think the cost of bamboo like this uh, over in uh, Europe, the UK and that, costs a bloody fortune. And there you go. There we have it. Them two big uh, stems of bloody uh, branches of bamboo all being cut up and uh, put by the bottom gate here to go up the left hand side to place down the bottom of the fence to stop the dogs digging out. But really we all know who's the one for digging out. So, yeah, there we go. You know, the object is to get this other side sorted out and let the dogs have a run over here as well as here. So, here we are. And so far, that bamboo's been placed along here to be fixed in. And here you can see on the fence side where uh, Mem's uh, placing these uh, bamboo stems just to secure it so we don't get uh, our rosy digging out. So yeah, 
Here she is here, doing the business. So, there you go.